hello friends welcome you all once again to my youtube channel today i am going to discuss special rules of syllogism i have already been discuss 10 general syllogistic rules you can watch that from the description box i have given the link to motivate me and for making new video please subscribe my channel so that you will easily get new uploaded videos. Let's discuss special syllogistic rules. Besides the general syllogistic rules, we have special syllogistic rules to determine the valid modes in different figure. General syllogistic rule ko chadi dele, aao kichhi rules achhi jota ki hala special syllogistic rules. The special syllogistic rule are different for each figure. Sabu figure pai. Alga alga rules achi. These rules can be uh, proved by the help of general syllogistic rule. Say jo 10 general syllogistic rules achi. Taha ko nahi ki special syllogistic rule determine hoy thay. Evang taha test kora jay. Then special syllogistic rule in figure 1. There are two special syllogistic rules that determine the valid modes in figure 1. Figure 1 ne duiti rules achi. Say special syllogistic rules ra. Number one, the major premise must be universal. That means major premise universal rohibo first figure re, and the minor premise must be affirmative. Minor premise ti affirmative rohibo. The major premise in figure one must be universal. Here is uh, this is the figure one major premise ti rohibo universal and minor premise ti rohibo affirmative. Then the second rules of special syllogistic rules in figure 2 there are two special syllogistic rules in figure 2 figure 2 re do it is special syllogistic rule achi setala number 1 the major premise must be universal major premise must be universal rahibo and one of the two premises must be negative do it a premise madhya ru gotiye nischint bhabare negative rahibo First rule ti ame padi thile je major premise universal ebong minor premise affirmative in figure 1 but in figure 2 major premise universal ebong one of the two premise must be negative dita premise madhye ru gote nischinta bhabare negative raibo in figure 2 then special syllogistic rules in figure 3 third figure re special syllogistic kon raibo in figure 3 there are three specialist special syllogistic rules figure uh, third re third figure re three noti special syllogistic rules hoji they are the first rule the minor premise must be affirmative minor premise affirmative raiba and uh, two rule number two the conclusion must be particular conclusion particular raiba and at least one of the premises must be universal at least do it a premise madhyaru gote nischinta bhavare universal raibo this is special syllogistic rules in figure third next special syllogistic rules in figure four fourth figure re special syllogistic rules kon raibo there are four special syllogistic rules in figure four they are charoti special rules raichi Syllogistic rules, special syllogistic rules, they are if the major premise is affirmative, then minor premise must be universal. Jodi major premise is affirmative, rohibo, thale minor premise is nischinta bhavare universal. Rohibo. If either of the premise is negative, jodhale vi gote premise jodi negative, rohibo, then the major premise must be universal. Major premise ti universal rahiva. Then if the minor premise is affirmative, jodi minor premise ti affirmative rahiva, then the conclusion must be particular. Conclusion particular rahiva. This is figure 4. The major premise is affirmative, then the minor premise must be universal. So there are 4 special syllogistic rules and it is for figure 1 2 rules figure 2 to again 2 rules figure 3 3 rules and figure 4 4 rules so there are 4 rules 
of special syllogism thank you i will come with a new video in the next session thank you